This is my altered book, inspired by Miss Shabby Dabby Doobadow, Miss Tina. The first one I've ever done. I did remember to put the string on there to close your This was the first time for me to use Distress Ink and to distress my pages and it was a true learning experience. I left the tags pretty much blank because I wanted a lot of writing space. The paper pack is uh, Lavender Bliss from maddiescraftingjoy.com. She had some beautiful papers. I collaged it with some music sheets and others that I had. Got a belly band here and a, a journaling card. <clears throat> Got a little bit of bling. Now, I'm not too good at the fussy cutting yet, but I'm working on it. Now, this one, I had this little tab down here. <clears throat> yeah, it works. <laughs> And we got this one, and we got this one, and I got tags in both. I also got me a new script stamp, I'm learning how to use it, and that's been fun. More journaling spaces. It has nine side pockets with large journaling cards. Get that out. This book had 195 pages and I took all out except for about 40. I used a little envelope and made this little pocket. It's got tags in it. And I have a little closure there for it. Some of these papers were Misty Blackburn's Digis that I got from her earlier this year. Put a little bit of lace. Instead of it looking vintage y, it uh, just about looks like grungy. Of course, this is my first time and I had so much fun. Oh my goodness. Some more of those papers from the paper kit. And this one here. This lifts up more journaling space. And then I just tuck it in there. Now this one just an added space, large journaling cards to write on, some more fussy cutting, this side opens up, I have more tags, more journaling cards. A 
Over here, I just have some more journaling tags in this little tuck. I did start putting some follow your heart and different words and sayings on this. But you can see where I've learned how to script and collage more of the digi kit from Misty's in here. I glued it wrong, so I made a side pocket. <laughs> More collaging. More words. Journaling cards. This is the center fold. Oops. One too many. Sorry. Little tag in pocket. Little envelope with writing papers and whatnot in it. I'm sorry the lighting's not very good journaling tags and everything. Now this one is a belly band and you stick something all the way through. And down here is a pocket. And up here, put more journaling space, give it a little something different. Beautiful papers. These are Kool-Aid stained papers. Uh, did those a while back, they're lavender. I think they go quite well with the paper, if you can tell. It's kind of a peach purple. Very pretty. And I added this, some of my sister's drawings. More words, more bling. Did some stamping. Just Extended the page out. <clears throat> Another journaling card. I put a little dangle, the bead on it, a little purple flower and green leaf. This writing space. This is more of Missy's Digi Kit. It's beautiful purple and pink flowers. I just kept collaging throughout, kind of. The whole book is the same theme, basically. This one is a folded envelope. Folded paper to look like an envelope. And then I've got text down here in the bottom. Oh yeah, more journaling cards, Got nice writing areas on the back, beautiful pictures, just a little bit of bling, music sheets. And this one just got tags and journaling spots. A little bitty pocket. And over here, I got this. Put 
pull out and then tuck underneath that little square there. I did leave the back paper open. This was from the original book. And then this is the back. These are original papers from the book. It's hardcover. It's my way of hiding the ribbon. I made this dangle and put it on a paper clip off the top. Now, the front <clears throat> This is my spine. I um uh, just so the front to cover up what was on it and give it some grit. And then I stamped it with distressed ink. Please don't do that. <laughs> if you're going to decoupage over it, don't. Unless you have permanent ink. Anyway, I decoupaged the napkin on it. It kind of muddied up, so I added... Uh, collage paper underneath and then I later it these three these are handmade flowers um, from crafting for less little birdie handmade flowers and I just think they are darling with all their little goodies But I had the best time, and this is my very first altered book, and I want to thank everybody for their inspiration, Miss Tina, Miss Robin, everybody that I watch. Uh, you girls are fabulous, and I appreciate it. Thank you so very, very much. Miss Mimi, thank you. Please subscribe to my channel, give me a thumbs up, and I want to thank you. Bye.